from an actor who is homeless to someone who started acting at the age of eight. These are the top 10 best male Hallmark Christmas actors. We're starting things off with an actor who played a Christmas phobe and yet managed to steal our hearts. Canadian actor Luke McFarlane has had a remarkably successful and long TV career. He has played the central character in a number of critically praised classic cult dramas, including Brothers and Sisters, Satisfaction, Mercy Street, The Night Shift, and Killjoys. The handsome actor joined the Hallmark Network back in 2014 and has gone on to become a fan favorite. McFarlane has also played the lead role in a number of classics like Christmasland, Maggie's Miracle Christmas, The Birthday Wish, and The Mistletoe Promise that aired on the Hallmark Channel. The Christmasland and The Mistletoe Promise are listed among his most famous Christmas movies. In the movie Christmasland, McFarlane plays the role of an adorable lawyer, Tucker Barnes, while Nikki DeLoach plays Jules Cooper, the owner of a Christmas tree farm. He, however, went out of his comfort zone and portrayed a very intriguing character named Nick, a Christmas phobe in the film The Mistletoe Promise. In the movie, strangely, he comes across Elise, who surprisingly is also a Christmas phobe. The two strangers who don't like to celebrate Christmas finally agree to handle holiday-related events just to kill time. But as the days pass, the two strangers first become friends and eventually fall in love with the magic of Christmas, of course. They quickly realize that they're headed down a path neither of them anticipated, and this would lead to a world of mixed emotions. The portrayal and the change in the relationship, going from strangers to partners to lovers, went so smoothly done that you can't help but fall in love with the entire plot yourself. Although he plays a hardcore romantic in most of his movies, in real life, McFarlane is still single. While we're not entirely sure what he's looking for in a partner, in an interview, he shared what he considers red flags in a relationship. Red flag is pretty simple for me. It's like rudeness or meanness. You know, no one's got time for that. McFarlane has now featured in several movies that he can be really proud of. But all this next actor needed was one big break that catapulted him into the top of the league. We're talking about the on-screen personality actor and food enthusiast, Jonathan Bennett. Apart from playing the lead in Cheaper by the Dozen 2, Van Wilder freshman year, MTV's Awkward, and All My Children, Bennett is best recognized for his portrayal of Aaron Samuels in the ever-so-famous teen movie Mean Girls. He participated in the Dancing with the Stars season 19 competition and also hosts show like Cake Wars and Halloween Wars in addition to the Times Square New Year's Eve celebration. Although Bennett starred in just one Hallmark movie in 2018, the plot and Bennett's incredible performance has continued to linger in the hearts of so many fans. The story of Christmas Made to Order revolves around a Christmas organizer, Gretchen, played by Alexa Penavega, who is hired by holiday host Stephen, played by Jonathan Bennett. Stephen is an amateur architect who will be hosting his family for the season, and things had to be perfect. Stephen's family comes together thanks to Gretchen's endearing Christmas spirit, but neither of the pair expected deepened bonds between one another. Eventually, Gretchen and Stephen are given an opportunity to decide what's more important to life. Who will they pick, and who will they let lose? This is the crux of the movie. Now before you start drilling all over Jonathan Bennett, let us remind you that our man here is taken, and the way the proposal came through will surely melt your heart. Taken or not, Jonathan, we still love you. But this next hunk is not just an amazing actor, but also a writer. The half-British and half-American David Hayden Jones has appeared in Twigs and Twine and Tasha Baines as a shapeshifter with no name and in seasons 12 to 15 of Supernatural as British men of letters Arthur Ketch. The actor who signed up for a degree in architecture at the prestigious McGill University simultaneously took up literature and theater out of sheer interest. He was instantly drawn to local bars where he frequently performed thanks to his innately funny nature. From Moliere, Gilbert, Sullivan to Shakespeare, the actor has a taste for classics, and he does not disappoint when it comes to the Hallmark Channel. Hayden Jones has starred in movies like A Cookie Cutter Christmas, My Christmas Dream, and A Bramble House Christmas, all of which have compelling plots that celebrate love, relationships, and of course Christmas. In the movie My Christmas Dream, the hot and handsome Hayden Jones is paired alongside the gorgeous Danica McKellar. 
plot revolves around a girl who wants to fulfill her goal of supervising the company's first international store, but the aspiring store manager of a well-known retail flagship store must seek the assistance of a struggling single father handyman. The store manager had no idea that her definition of a perfect dream was just about to change forever. While Hayden Jones has the knack of balancing his acting and writing, this next actor from the popular series Gossip Girl might just be the next Christmas king. Sam Page, thus far, has had a rather diverse TV career. He has starred in several TV shows like Mad Men, Gossip Girl, House of Cards, and The Bold Type. In 2016, Page became a member of the Hallmark Channel team and has continued to collaborate with them ever since. Each of Paige's Christmas movies is a classic of its own right, from the perfect Christmas present to a royal New Year's Eve. Paige has aced at every role that he has played, but none like the movie Christmas in Rome. It's so soothing to watch this heartthrob adorn our TV screens, but this next actor who once featured in TV commercials shot to fame with Hallmark. Colin Ferguson has bagged pivotal roles in several popular TV shows, including You're the Worst, Cedar Cove, The Vampire Diaries, Eureka, and Haven on the Hallmark Channel. And how can we forget his portrayal as the Maytag man in the company ads? Ferguson has contributed consistently to Hallmark since 2016, both in the Christmas and murder mysteries genre. Ferguson has so far made appearances in three of the most cherished films on the channel. Every Christmas has a story, Christmas on Honeysuckle Lane, and Christmas in Montana. And this man has some high regards for the Hallmark Network. Ferguson has managed to impress us with his versatility and ease, but this next actor transitioned from soap operas to a Hallmark staple. Matheson needs no introduction. Be it Christmas or romance, this stud is among the most successful performers in both genres. Between 1998 and 2011, Matheson appeared in almost a thousand episodes of All My Children. And finally, in 2013, he transitioned over to the Hallmark Channel. The actor and host hasn't slowed down even for a bit since then. The Christmas Ornament, Window Wonderland, A Christmas to Remember, and The Christmas Club are the four holiday movies we surely remember Matheson for. And our man here is really big on Christmas traditions when it comes to real life as well. Well, one thing we know for sure is what we binge on some Cameron Matheson movies as part of our family's Christmas tradition. But one movie from this next actor is enough to brighten our day. Andrew Walker had a very successful acting career before beginning his work with Hallmark. His performances in shows like Sabrina the Teenage Witch, Reba the Big Bang Theory, and Flashpoint were noteworthy. Walker, however, has become unquestionably one of the most well-liked cast members on the Hallmark Channel since joining in 2012. A Bride for Christmas, A Dream of Christmas, A Christmas in Tennessee, Mary and Bright, and Christmas on My Mind are some of his most famous Hallmark Christmas movies. Ashley Green was totally excited to be working with the one and only Andrew Walker. While Walker's fans are spread across all ages, this next actor started his first gig at the age of eight years old. He is a successful actor, director, producer, editor, and author. We're talking about Hallmark's charming hero, Tyler Hines. Hines has been a mainstay of the Hallmark Channel since 2018. He is undoubtedly set for a lengthy run of creating a lasting impression on his fans. Before bagging significant roles for the Hallmark Channel, Hines had already made a mark for himself. He first started off with a three-day performance of a musical titled A Christmas Carol, where he played 10-year-old Tommy. It's Christmas Eve was his debut holiday film with Network, and he has not looked back since. Undoubtedly, one of the most well-liked actors, some of his movies include On the Twelfth Date of Christmas, The Mistletoe Secret, My Christmas Family Tree, and An Unexpected Christmas. Well, we can watch this man day in and day out, and yet we never get enough of him. But we're grateful that this next actor, who first started off as a model, found his way to the Hallmark Channel. American model and actor Ryan Peavy is best known for playing Nathan West on the ABC serial drama General Hospital. And did you know that Peavy has modeled alongside Cher and Katy Perry? Well, in January 2016, the Hallmark Channel released the original film that we all love him for, Unleashing Mr. Darcy. In just a few years, Peavy has made a mark for himself so much with Christmas and winter movies. From Harvest Love, 
hope at Christmas, a timeless Christmas, to Christmas at the Plaza, Pavey has managed to take center stage in all of them. Now, we know you're looking forward to the holidays as well, but right now, we're looking forward to a ton of likes and shares from you, which truly means the world to us. To keep such entertaining videos coming, make sure you subscribe to our channel if you haven't already. With that, let's move to this British actor who never fails to steal our hearts. Dwayne Henry is well known for his work on NCIS Doctors and We, but you might not know that Henry was homeless at a certain point in his life. Henry has said that even if he weren't an actor, he would still be involved in the arts, perhaps working as a talent scout or teaching drama to younger people. Henry starred in Hallmark's A Gingerbread Romance alongside Tia Mowry Hardrick, and it looks like the actress had fun during the shoot. That must have been really fun. So these were the top 10 best male Hallmark Christmas actors. Who among these is your favorite? Now imagine three of your favorites working on one single movie. What does that call for? Celebration! Do you know which Christmas movie we're talking about? Let us know in the comments below. Thanks for watching. Until next time.